Lucasaurus here, and today we're going to start on something kind of wild. It is Super Zenkaiser, a beautiful model by Zachers. He killed it on this, and my printer, as you know, per usual, butchered it. It's kind of hard to see, but we get a big layer shift here, all the way around from the top on the bottom. And this is the second one I printed. Uh, the first one did the same thing, so I was like, okay, maybe I need more supports. Put more supports on it did it a little bit higher so i don't know i give up this was a lot of plastic and a lot of time and that's not even counting the two that failed in between <laughs> so we have two like this i think i'm gonna like proceed with both of them maybe the back's printing right now and there's a lot of other parts you got the uh stunt visor ish thing you got the front lens cover we're gonna do the buck four there's the emblem there's these weird like circle things on the side we're gonna print out and then there's horns you know it's a it's a thing it's a thing it's uh it's gonna be a process i'm gonna try to cut this and weld it together uh, i'll try to get some footage of it it gets pretty intense but we're just gonna take multi-tool get in here cut all around and once i i'll make a line so i know because up here it's hard to tell or it's well, i guess it's not so we'll do that we'll cut that we'll weld that back on where it's supposed to be same with the bottom down here and hopefully it looks okay. We did do that with uh, King Ojo Black, if you saw that, Hachi Ojo. I'm over it. Let's get to it. And if we ruin it, then you'll never see this video, and maybe one day I'll try this again. But I would like to get this done. This helmet's sick. I think a lot of people are going to like it. I know a lot of Tommy fans are out there, and you like your Dragon Zord. And this is literally Zenkaiser in the mouth of the Dragon Zord, and it's sick. So let's get to it. All right, we are going to cut around this layer shift the best we can and then we will weld it back on in place at least try to use 3d pen to attach these parts that I cut shouldn't be a big deal uh, I did it to the first one already and it turned out okay so We're going to attach the top horn and the side pieces. I cannot get them to fit uh, with the way they are fit over the pegs. So I've just been using the soldering iron to make the holes bigger and just kind of 
shove them on and then glue them on. So I did the first one, <laughs> it was a test. This one we don't have the tape off yet, so it might be a big disaster under here, but we're going to give that a shot and see how it looks in the end. Went okay. Got it all attached here. I'm gonna do touch-ups probably next and then figure out, I'm gonna vacuum form the visor get the inner visor in, and then we'll figure out the teeth, the touch-ups, detail lining, and hopefully it's looking okay by then. We'll see. Got all the detail lines done almost, just gotta do a couple on the side here. And then I'm going to use the soldering iron to widen out the holes for the emblems to go. And then we're gonna get the clear coat on it and the visor, and then we'll get mad into elastic and we'll get to the spin around. <laughs> insane insane this thing looks insane i love it uh, i can't believe we pulled this off somehow with how bad these prints were felt as you saw in the beginning we did rush a little bit at the end i'll be 100 percent honest we did a little bit i was trying to get these done for go go ranger station we did if you were at go go ranger station and you saw us in person make sure you leave a comment i appreciate it uh sadly it didn't sell there but you know it's a power ranger convention and You'd be surprised a lot of Power Rangers people don't know about Super Zenkaiger, which is a shame because everyone loves uh, Dragon Caesar, the Dragon Zord, and it's pretty much what this helmet is, uh, but with Zenkaiser in there, and it's just awesome. It's so cool. I love this thing. Honestly, Dezakers killed it with this file. Make sure you go pick it up for yourself. It's intimidating. There are a lot of pieces, a lot of pieces. <laughs> it all fits together nicely, though. I will give him that. Uh, anything that didn't seem to fit together nicely was probably because of my printer and not him. Had a little bit of issues up here. I uh, missed a tiny bit of clear on the side. And we didn't quite get the edges painted on here. And they're kind of visible because where the raft was, it kind of didn't print correctly. But, you know, it doesn't matter. I, I don't think anyone's going to notice that. They'll be too busy looking at, you know, this. You know, it's insane. It's insane. Two of these ones was too much. Too much. Two is my cutoff. For doing helmets at the time anymore three burned me out uh but two of these is definitely too much definitely way way too many pieces but i i hope you enjoyed this i know i did i commissioned this file the zackers has it available so if you're interested in it pick it up it's something i always wanted to do i'm slowly getting through all the zen kaiser stuff they will redo two kaiser and add his v fin for his uh, q rex mode i don't remember what it's called but yeah i hope you enjoyed this i know i did uh, but thanks for watching. Follow me on TikTok, Instagram, and Twitter, Stickasaurus, Facebook, Stickasaurus, Cups with the Props. Down in the description, you find a link tree. There's a link to the Twitch, which is Stickasaurus Rex. We're live every Saturday and Sunday in the morning and the afternoon, as well as the Discord. If you want to come hang out, be friends, talk, whatever you're into. The Patreon, we have a $1 tier. Uh, you can join exclusive videos, as well as you get to vote on the Community Build Helmets and the Helmet Refresh Helmets. Till next time, have a great day.